Welcome everyone back to another video. I'm back with part 9 of WWE Smackdown vs Raw 2007 career mode. Um, part 9, man, it's quite mad, isn't it? 9 episodes. And we're nowhere near the end because uh, we got to see all of these pay-per-views. If anyone remembered anything that happened in the last episode, then um, you would have known that we have encountered two different storylines. So we ended one. Uh, playing a steel cage tornado tag if you haven't seen it I recommend giving it a watch as it was really interesting to see exactly how I nearly got my ass beat but it's not that bad we won at the end uh, but uh, go have a look and see what other storyline we encountered which we're going to proceed on today uh, this storyline for anyone who's played this game will know how crazy it is it includes weird magic uh, from this wand uh, and you're gonna get a, more of a taste in this episode so before we get right in if you like these type of videos then please do hit the like button and if you are not subscribed already then please consider hitting the subscribe button we're on 83 subs which is not bad compared to what we were on just a couple of days ago so we are really booming really quick but uh, we're trying to get to 100 as soon as possible so if you are not subscribed already then please do consider hitting the subscribe button and if you haven't hit the notification button yet then do hit that button so that you get notified as soon as possible so let's just get straight into this episode well look who it is i mean i've heard of a glass jaw there sport but you must have the world soft as noggin you got ko'd last week by a piece of plastic piece of plastic my ass what's in that baton it knocked me out cold and cost me my match it's not a baton, it's a magic wand. And the only thing that it's loaded with is magic. Look here, Wicked Witch of the West. Keep that magic wand to yourself from now on. What? Wicked Witch? That's it. You and me in the ring tonight. What? You gotta be kidding. I don't do bikini contests. What the hell? See, this is the crazy I shit I was talking about this story mode. Friend. Apparently, we get turned here. into a girl, girl to fight a girl. Cena is just turned into a girl. Oh shit. Hey, what up, sexy thing? Shut up! Alright, so we got a new message from. Oh my days. This guy, man. Hey, dog, what's up? This is Big Fist. I just wanted to say. I can't believe what happened to you tonight. That's some crazy magical type stuff. Good luck on your match, though. And, uh, you know, I was wondering, maybe we could get together and uh, have a couple of drinks after the match tonight. What do you think? I'll see you later. Hell no. Doesn't this idiot know what just happened? Oh, my God. All right, we're deleting that. That was just visceral man he, he's down bad all right so we've got this crazy match of cena versus candace um normally i would play this match but i'm just not going to bother because regardless of whether i win or not it doesn't make a difference um so i'll just skip it for this one oh we won anyway so let's see what the cutscenes show So how are you enjoying being a WWE diva? At first, it was kind of weird. But now, wow, look at me. I'm a perfect 10. A perfect 10? Oh, please. This is what a perfect 10 looks like. I hate to tell you, you're not a perfect 10. A 9, maybe. But him, I, I mean her. You know, Edge, I think even Davari could have put that better. In fact, let's find out. Check on Kenny, my man! Check on Kenny! He can sit on your man, Nista! He didn't get in this! And check on the machine job! Check on the machine job! Whoa! We've got a rematch tonight. And like I said, you're going to see what it's like to be in the ring with the perfect 10. Did you just see how ridiculous it was? 
Viscera still came through the door with flowers and he turned me back to how I'm meant to be and he just made um, Edge speak a different language. It's crazy. So we, we're facing Candace again. I'm not really sure how. If we're facing her, we must be facing her as, as Cena. But let's see what happens in this one. A number of strange events take place, but the one that still has me puzzled is Candace's comment about being a You know, I don't think he had any idea that his comments about Candace Michelle would lead to any of this. How could he? As far as I can tell, everything we're seeing here is completely impossible. I certainly have no earthly explanation for it. I've seen many a strange thing in my time, but nothing like what we see. A big New England welcome from Portland, Maine. This is good old JR Tim Ross. So we're, we're genuinely facing Candace like seen a crowd so far proper. Up, JR. I, I don't I get, get it, but uh and neither can I. let's get straight in. King, I don't think Portland's gonna know what hit it after tonight. This doesn't feel weird at all, right? I ain't gonna get cancelled. Throw her down. Oh, okay. <laughs> Five knuckle shuffle to Candice Michelle. Why are you so eager to hear my prediction? Because I want to know who's going to win. And nine times out of ten, it's not the superstar you pick. That the exact same. Okay, she just reversed. Okay. Straight in the gut. So what did everybody think of this week's WWE Smackdown? Uh, I'm surprised as we've not even seen a single Lesnar appearance since SummerSlam, but um, I'm assuming they're waiting until WrestleMania or Royal Rumble. But obviously, Royal WrestleMania is really far. Royal Rumble's still quite far, even though it's in January. Uh, I reckon one finisher and she should be out. But my momentum buy isn't even going up. And I'm not sure why. All right, Cena's momentum's nearly up. All right, Cena's momentum's up. One finisher. He thinks we're going for it. Candice Michelle. This is the main event fight right here. I've got to say, JR, he's going for the cover, JR. One, two, three. Three. Oh, damn! Sure. Yo, she's done better than most of the guys we've faced so far. Kudos. Wow. Listen to these fans, JR. You can... I don't see why Candace agreed to this match, JR. She should join us on commentary. She can sit on my lap, and we can talk about the first thing that pops up. Folks, <laughs> Did you just say what he said? That was hilarious. <laughs> Alright, one more finisher on the hard floor outside the ring. She's still away. I, couldn't, I wanted to pin her inside the ring, but right, she's now got a red red body. So, oh my gosh, she's literally a reverse queen. I just want this over and done with now. One, two, three. What? That's the second time. This is actually crazy. I have to do three finishes in order to get her out. She's literally done better than any other guy. Alright, third, finish, oh my here, god. Alright, in the middle, oh, pulling her by her hair. Okay, now this is going to be quite painful to watch, but bang! <laughs> Alright, let's see if this works. This is like the third pin of the match. One, two, oh my god. She's invincible. I'm complaining. Oh, damn. Okay, maybe she shouldn't have done that. 
tell me more Am I gonna, is she really going to bleed before she well, actually does anything? Right. And there's the cover. One, two, finally. She's done better than last others, though. No, 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 oh no, not again. You two stay the hell away from me. You're crazy. I don't want anything to do with you. Huh, she won't make me quit as my bed, I has to. My bed, hey, big up, be a best to that to my bed. That's it. I'm out of here. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> I'm not done with you yet. It's my man, Boogeyman. And then I'm here, I'm to pick it up. Fine. Whatever. I'll be in the ring. Okay, so... Okay, I, I'm slightly confused. She turned a Boogeyman... No, wait, she turned Edge into Boogeyman, and now I'm somehow facing both of them. Either way, it's one on tag, so uh, let's get this one over and done with. I'm the Boogeyman. Well, I must sound like a broken record by now, but I simply cannot believe what we're seeing backstage. One minute, there was no Boogeyman, and then there were two. Yeah, and the Boogeyman's a SmackDown superstar. What's he doing on Raw? King, that is quite honestly the very least of my concerns right now. I agree. I'm not used to this entrance, and I have to admit, it really creeps me out. Too bad Candace isn't here with her wand. Did I just hear you right? Did you just say that if Candace and her wand were here, that'd make you feel safer? You think you know me. And here is Haley from Toronto, Canada. Hey. Well, sort of. I think it's X, JR, but how can we be sure? <laughs> so, I'm facing two Boogeymans. This is WWE 2007 for you, by the way. This is why this is the best. I can't believe this man hasn't lost his mind yet, King. As crazy as all the recent goings on has seemed to us, he's been right in the middle of it. His mind must be completely blown, JR. If he stops to try to make sense out of any of it, he might just lose it. My advice to him would be to go with the flow. That and, well, I never thought I'd say this, stay the heck away from Candace Michelle. Good old JR, Tim Ross here with Jerry the King Lawler welcoming you to Raw live from Los Angeles, California. I love this town, JR. And I hope I get a chance so, to audition some young I'm facing player. two boogeymans, which one of them's actually edge, and I'll just Personally, confirm by going to this corner. The other one's definitely boogeyman, which is really weird. Either way, we're actually facing boogeyman right now. While Edge is in the corner, this is a handicapped tag handicapped tag tag match. I think that's what we can call it. But uh straight away we're in for a five knuckle shuffle on Boogeyman. The real one. Sure, this arena is just full of edge heads tonight. You might not hear them cheering, but that's probably because they're in all the fact. All right, still got him with that punch. I think I know who's gonna win this one, JR. Oh, really? Enlighten this king. Wait a second. Looks like they got the tag, right. JR. Tagging. He saw that one coming. Okay, we're just slapping each other now. Wait, so what's happening here? He's trying to kick Edge out, who's actually legal right now. But anyway, Edge goes down. Boogeyman, to be fair, nearly had his finisher before he left. Okay. Okay. Nice. That's how we do it. This is just weird to look at, though, ain't it? Oh my god, please let me up. I'm so happy that we have a superstar like Edge on the Raw roster. Someone who sets goals for himself and doesn't let anything stop him from reaching them. He's a great role right. model for young fans. In his backup, oh, Boogie Man, model, still right. on a yellow. Edge is a real humanitarian. A guy who just that suplex, straight in. Pick him up, throw him in the opposite corner, away from Edge. Nasty rumor spread by 
Okay, now let's do our work. Not like that. How do you miss, Cena? This capacity crowd is making their opinions known tonight. They sure are, JR. Let's throw him out of the ring. I can't tell if he's the I think he is the legal one who I just threw out. Alright, there he keeps on reversing. He's trying to go back to Boogeyman. We're not gonna let him. We are gonna do damage. Oh my god, rare. Oh I'm just so unlucky. Now I'm getting smacked in the back of the head. Ref, dirty right. move. He's sure not going to win over any fans with that move, but I don't think that bothers him too much, quite frankly. Right, so I can't tell if this is kind of even or not. I mean, I am getting my ass beat, but I'm still on a yellow. Boogeyman's on an orange. I just got smacked up. So, JR, are you enjoying the match so far? Yes, I am. I think these superstars are putting on one hell of an exhibition here tonight. What's your favorite part of it so far? I don't think it's happened yet. Keep your words soft and sweet. Alright, we've now given Boogeyman red damage. He's going to want to go and get Edge as soon as possible. So we just got to stop that. And if they're smart, they'll listen. Remember, without these fans... We haven't even had our finisher once yet. And they keep on reversing. No, 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 no. You ain't going back. Hey there. Let's get our finisher up. Cena is his own biggest fan. How come all of these rappers can't talk about anything except how great they are? I don't think there's anything wrong with that, King. Cena's got all right, let's see who the... I don't know who to do it to. Okay. What a counter! Okay. Oh, my God. No. Oh. Nice. Let's go. Oh, no, I think he's... Oh, no, I got it. I got it. Superstars sure aren't going easy on each other here tonight. What you expect, King? Oh this my god, I'm trying to knock him off. Oh, really, there we go. Gosh, tell me more about your in Oh my experience. god, I hate well, this game. I don't, but it's annoying me right now. To my credit. How about you? All the same. Oh, come on, quick, 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 quick. One, two. Oh, I'll Alright, get up, get up, get up. Get up. Tina, get up. No. I think we're gonna find out just how much punishment the human body can with the limit. I love that attitude, JR. Oh no. Go go I'm gonna be on the red in a sec. This is uncomfortable, but he can't do it for long. And you won't find more incredible athletes than the WWE superstars. You're not wrong, King. This is that chance. Oh my god. No Edge, go away. You might give up. If, 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 you right might give up. Oh, I'm ignoring it. Oh, I wanted to ignore it. I missed the chance. You can't take this kind of pain for long. That one many times. All right, let's get Edge in the face. And that is not the oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Give up, give up, give up, give up, give up, give up. Give up. Please give up. Please give up. Please give up. Please give up. Oh my. Okay, I'm completely out of stamina. I could say though, this is a good match. Alright, let me go up. Pick you back down a bit. Save the finisher. And then let's... This. I think I might win this by counting him out. If I throw him out, I'll definitely be able to... Alright, if I can kick Edge out after this, we won this. Alright, done that. Kick Edge out. Stamina up a bit. Bang. Alright, pin! 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 Oh! Oh my god. Okay, I'm sick of Edge. You know what? Hit me, tap Edge in. I want to kick his ass. I think I know who's going to win this match, but I don't want to say. <laughs> Just 
just got double teamed. Did you ever think it oh my god, I swear. You know what? The ref deserves it. He deserves it. Oh my god. Boogeyman just done his finisher. He's not, there's no way he'll be able to do it. Oh, he's gonna pin me. He's gonna pin me. No, 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 no. The ref, there's no 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 ref. Right? There's no ref, right? Uh, Cena, just kick out. Oh my, no way. Cena. Oh my god. Okay, well, um, that was annoying, hard, and just difficult uh <laughs> this is a crazy storyline and i'm not even sure if it's over we've still got to face him in SummerSlam. but uh i hope you enjoyed today's video if you did please do hit a like button and if you are not subscribed already then please do consider hitting the subscribe button and also switch on notifications so you get notified as soon as i upload um i think that's all hopefully we'll bring out more episodes we're doing a lot more series so make sure you stay tuned stay safe and peace